Chapter 1.5.5. Chapter 5 explains how computers change power projection tactics, both abstract and physical. Chapter 5 takes the core concepts presented in chapters 3 and 4 and uses them to present a novel explanation about why Bitcoin could be groundbreaking, a groundbreaking new type of physical power projection technology rather than merely a monetary technology. This chapter begins with a deep dive into computer science and the challenges associated with software system security. The author utilizes core concepts presented in the previous chapter to point out how the emergence of modern computing has empowered software engineers to create abstract power and use it to give themselves asymmetric and unimpeachable control over one of 21st century society's most precious resources, bits of information. The first half of chapter five illustrates how the current architecture of the internet makes society highly vulnerable to mass scale systemic exploitation and abuse from computer programmers. It argues that society is going to invent new types of physical power projection technologies to secure themselves against exploitation and abuse via cyberspace. After highlighting this vulnerability, the author proceeds into a multi-part explanation of how proof-of-work technologies like Bitcoin could be used to mitigate these emergent threats by empowering people to impose severe physical costs on belligerent actors in, from, and through cyberspace. Man, I hope they put that on his gravestone. The second half of chapter five presents novel theories about proof of work protocols. Here, the author performs a deep dive about why he believes Bitcoin may represent the discovery and utilization of complete, of completely new type of state mechanism called the planetary state mechanism. I think I missed the line. I'm going to start that again, even if I didn't. The second half of chapter five presents novel theories about proof of work protocols. Here, the author performs a deep dive about why he believes Bitcoin may represent the discovery and utilization of completely new, of a completely new type of state mechanism called the planetary state mechanism. Typo missing a. Uh. He argues that Bitcoin could represent humanity's adoption of global scale planetary computer. He argues that Bitcoin could represent humanity's adoption of a global scale planetary computer that has been intentionally reverse optimized to be as expensive as possible to operate, given it irreproducible emergent properties that would be physically impossible for ordinary computers to replicate. He argues that Bitcoin could represent humanity's adoption of a global scale planetary computer that has been intentionally reverse optimized to be as expensive as possible to operate, given it irreproducible, irreproductible. emergent properties that would be physically impossible for ordinary computers to replicate. The purpose of chapter five is to present a completely different perspective about Bitcoin using a completely different theoretical framework that has little to do, little to nothing to do with money, finance or economics, but everything to do with computer science and national strategic security. Using power projection theory, the author highlights how technologies like Bitcoin could have socio-technical implications which exceed our current understanding of this technology, not just with respect to computer science and cybersecurity, but also with respect to national strategic security as a whole. The author concludes this chapter with an argument that Bitcoin could represent a new way of war fighting called soft war that could be forever that could forever change international power dynamics and even mitigate a strategic level stalemate between nuclear superpowers. 
The primary takeaway from this chapter is that Bitcoin could represent the discovery of what the author describes as human antlers.